I've seen that in Colorado Springs. A lot of people are actually making things and showing things, and there are places that are, are welcoming to artists here, which I think is great. It's very grassroots, um, which I really like. Yeah. 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 Yes. We're doing this. Yes. yes. Yeah, you like that? Yeah. 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 sketch first if you're going to be drawing things, but I always uh, make sketches and uh, outlines, you know, just very simple line drawings and graph it out and graph that even scale it out larger out on my canvas and work from photographs and sketches. What do you find challenging about um, commissions? I did my, my first commission recently and I'm like, oh, this is scary. I think, um, trying to get it exactly what they want, I think is the big thing. Um, I mean, I do the similar kind of stuff where commissions yeah. do maybe between 20, 25 and like two months or something, depending on who wants what. Yeah. Um, but I start off like with the work that I have here, doing what I I feel like I get creative about, and I get passionate about, and then people see that and they're like, oh my God, I want you to do this for me. I want you to turn, you know, this thing. But typically oh. I just, Make it into squares, you know, and graph out my photograph and graph out my canvas. You just do it square by square. Is that how you paint too? Do you paint square by square too? No. No. Yeah. No. That just gets my layout. Yeah. 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 How do you choose what uh, what inspired? Like what what usually inspires you? Is it like a, like a common theme? Um, a common theme in a lot of my paintings are going to be cloud work. You know, I'm very inspired by. I don't want to say just sunsets, but cloud formations and just how clouds can define the space, you know, around us. I'm just always amazed that, you know, there's this whirling world above us all the time and it's so easily overlooked, you know, a lot of the time. And but it you can almost always look I and mean, look up and be inspired, you know, by the clouds and different formations that they're making and just all the colors, the run of colors that you can see in the sky. So clouds are definitely a running theme in a lot of my paintings, be they commissioned or, you know, more of series work that I do for shows. It's like, you're going to talk about and then it comes out great, you're like, you learn something new and it can be put into something else later. Yeah. For sure. For sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> paintings. Paintings, yeah. <laughs> the technique do you use? Me? Oh, yeah. yeah um, technique, I normally do, right now, uh, block printing, so I basically carve backward pictures out yeah. of blocks of wood <laughs> and uh, then print them onto paper, and that's what I normally do. Uh, do you use like the chisels, like the little like V chisel? Like, how yeah, it's it? actual, like it has a handle. Yeah. yeah, and there's a whole bunch of different kinds of uh, tips that you can use. There's big tips, small tips, you know, just to get into the lining. But yeah, that's what you use, and I've damaged my fingers so bad with using those, yeah. yeah. Especially with uh, linoleum blocks, because that's, that's the thing. Yeah, I've done a linoleum block way, way back when. Like, you know, <laughs> not to any series or anything, but I've used those little, those little V, you know, chisels and stuff. They're so sharp. They are, and it's easy. Like, they have this stuff called, uh, like, easy, e easy On or something, and it's almost like a stamp. Uh -huh. Like like the bottom of the stamp, and that that's so much easier to use. But if you don't get as clean lines that you would in the lens. With the million, because it's yeah. nice. Sometimes we can almost treat art or music like a commodity, like mm -hmm. just really consumption based. Just like, oh, I like this, so I'm going to look at or listen to it a million times. And I do that. I do that with music that I love. Yes. Um, and and with art that I love. I mean, we have it in our homes and, and that sort of thing. But um, I think taking a moment to, to think about why was this created and what what was this created out of? It's been very inviting, you know, for an artist, a new artist in town, and being able to show at multiple places, you know, just wanting to, you know, and meeting a few people that uh, introducing to other people and being able to have the opportunity, you know, and I really have found people that are working artists, you know, and showing stuff and it's not like you have to seek them out extremely, you know, it's really hard to do that, you know, it's pretty much on the on the surface around here. Yeah. In, in certain areas if you know where to look. Yeah. There's an openness.
know for me, I put a, a lot of thought into every detail of my music from the, you know, the rhythm to the tone of the guitar to the way that I'm, I'm singing and the tone of my voice or the, um, the way that I'm saying specific words. So the amount of emotion and thought and um, just authenticity that goes into one piece, even in a live setting, is, uh, is very vulnerable because it's almost like putting your, your heart and your journal and what I'm a hands-on person, so I love getting in it. Kind of pushing it. Pushing, yes. Yeah, pushing it or just manipulating yeah. it. Yeah, right? and seeing it how I see it. Yeah. Instead of how, you know, it's mm. kind of seen for me. Yeah. Yes. Very well put. So, I like that. Yeah. I like that a lot. Yeah. That's what it is. That's what the art is. It Taking is it in and putting it out in some other, other way, you know? <laughs> no. It's just like your way of putting it out. You know, yeah. and so everybody weird. just puts it out some different right, way. Yeah. You know, there's no way that you can put it out the same way, and you yeah. can just it's endless. Yeah. It's cool. It's exciting. Hey, so there's everything. It's <laughs> awesome. You're inspirational here. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. I like it. <laughs> Anything else that you particularly want to say? Uh, um, thank you. Yeah. Like yeah. seriously, thank you. Um, Thank you, Rooted Studios. Yes, thank you, Rooted Studios. Merit. Merit it, lovely lady. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, we really appreciate it, and we're really happy to to show here and have another yeah. uh, area to show sure, art and yeah. uh, meet people and uh, have a good time. Yeah, good. Awesome. <laughs>